Ramblin' Rusty here. This morning I stopped by Emmanuel's ground just to see what was happening. I saw that Philip was out in the field working with some crazy looking machine. And he'd have to stop every now and then and go around to the other side of the machine. And so here's Philip right here uh, telling me a little about it and he's gonna do some recording from a distance. And so basically what happens is that they have these little paper chains and they're filled with potting soil and you plant seeds in each one of these little links in the chain. You put these in the small greenhouses and you water them. And so they get a head start on the weeds. And then um, you, you just pull it slowly down and it automatically feeds this chain of seeds and potting soil together and uh, go clear to the end of the row. And so I got a chance to do some. And the, the next section that you're going to see is uh, some of the seeds that I planted. And here's Philip having to pull out and get the chain so that they will come out easily when I pull the machine down the row. And uh, it was a really uh, ingenious device. I don't know who uh, basically came up with it, but uh, I'll have to come back and uh, take some pictures of, of uh, what it looks like uh, Sunday. I'll go back and do that. Okay, I came back out here to Emmanuel's ground and the rows of spinach that I put in are these uh, last two right over in here. Since then, he has planted something else. I'm not sure what it is. It might be cilantro, but here are some of the other rows that he also planted before. And of course, planting them on with the trays and then stringing them out gives a head start on the weeds. Now I will try to show you a little bit of how they make the string of spinach to be planted. Notice in this one, you can see the little uh, compartments there. They are paper things filled up with potting soil and they are a long string of that brought out. Also here in the greenhouse, you will see many other uh, greens that uh, will be taken to the cafeteria to use for the microgreens for salads. So there's always something going on here in the small greenhouses. Something is sprouting out. Next, I'll show you some things outside. One of the first things you notice here is part of our irrigation system. This irrigation is set up so we can both irrigate above and as a drip line right next to the plants. Here is a section of uh, plants that you see growing. There are carrots and there are many other uh, plants that are growing for the garden. I know that uh, part of them are beets. I'm not sure the names of some of these other things. I'm right, rather ignorant on that. But I, I know one thing, things are growing well here on Emmanuel's ground, and this will be much food to be used by the cafeteria. Ramblin' Rusty signing off for now. Please tune in again to see what, where I will be and what I will be doing next.